doing? You doing good? You doing good, son? Hi, hey, how are you? What's up? How are you doing this week? Uh, it's me, Rocky. Hi, if you're new to this channel, hello, I am Rocky. Um, welcome. What's good? Hey, nice to see you again, dude. How have you been, dude? Nice to see you again. A uh, long time no see. You're looking freaking cute. I hope you know that. Oh my god. Well, hi, I'm Rocky, if you're new here. Um, I'm a dumb 22-year-old who works at a thrift store and loves giant shoes and is in college for graphic design. Cool. I just love my shoes. I love shoes. I don't know if you feel this way, but I am a shoe addict. Love shoes, love shoes, love shoes. And I've been in love with platforms for so long. Like, I remember... Ooh. I remember being a little girl and my mom bought me really big Skechers sneakers so I could go to Six Flags and ride all the rides, which it worked. I would put like a big bow on my hair and I'd have my big Skechers and they'd let me on all the big rides. And still to this day, I love roller coasters. I love platforms. I love my mom. Nothing's changed. So I thought I would show my platform collection Maybe throw in a few heels and maybe a sneaker or two. We'll see. We'll see how crazy I get. I got I got class later, so I thought I'd do this. I don't really know what else to film. If there's something you guys want to see me do, like you know, you can you can always put it down there, put it downtown. Um, I think we should obviously start. I put a few of them right here. I'll go get more later. We should start with the OGs. These these are some toque creepers. I've had them since high school, which it's kind of crazy to see that they're coming back into style, into season. Um, but yes, these are my toques. Um, they're just the black leather toques. There are two inch platforms. I remember me and all my girlfriends we all got these and we were bad little bitches and I remember I used to feel very insecure about wearing them to high school. I thought they made me look too high, but honestly, they are not that big of a platform. Like, that looks like an inch and a half, two inches, maybe. But I love them. Um, my only con with these is like, they're kind of like the, my only con with the toques, even though I love them, is like the laces kind of suck and they get untied really easy and they become giant flip-flops after a while, but man, did I love these. I should have never felt that way. I just used to care too much what people thought of me. That fucking was bad for my mental health. Yeah, woo! Okay, so the next boys I have, you know, these are the infamous Jaden Docs, you know, the ones that every girl has. I've had these for what, since like late 2018? I want to say the summer of 2018 is when I got them. Maybe I love them. I had to take them to the shoe doctor. We have a place here in Austin called the shoe, Austin Shoe Hospital. Highly recommend if you live in the area and you need your shoes fixed. The zipper on both of these broke because they couldn't go over my big old ankles slash I was too lazy to untie <laughs> the ties. But I love them. They just, they literally go with everything. They're like my staple and they're so comfy. And then stemming off of that, I guess we'll just go through the docks. These are my low docks. They are platform little Oxford babies and they have this like good cush around the edges so you don't get blisters um these are just like you know the academia going with the skirt look like ugh, they're very precious and also literally a staple in my wardrobe <laughs> can i not hold these also a staple in my wardrobe just you know a classic black little platform uh, so next up we have our platform Doc Martin Mary Janes, like come on girl, they're so freaking cute. 
I used to have low Mary Janes, but I sold them on Depop to buy the chunkers because it's like, why not? <laughs> they are absolutely precious. I am a Mary Jane lover, me and Fergie both. And I, I bet more people out there too, but my beautiful platform docs, they can just make something look so girly and so cute. Ugh, I love them. For boys, I have. It's going to be the, the white versions of the Jadon Doc Martens. Now these, these are some bad boys. I love them. You know, you never know when you need boots. And if you love something as much as I love my Doc Martens, I had to get the white version. They are so cute. I got these in New York when I went in 2019 before the end of the world and they are my babies and the zippers on these have not broken oddly i do feel like like the colored leather other than black is a little bit harder to break in the white was just a little more you know holding its holding its ground fighting me back but i definitely after a while i got them to break in not too bad pair i have are my spice girls moment these are my chunky buffaloes, Buffalo London sneakers. Ooh, they're dirty at the bottom. Don't, don't look at that. They're kind of dirty. I need to clean them up to be honest, but they're just like your chunky white trainers. Literally could go with anything and everything. And then they make me kind of feel like baby spice when I wear them. And who doesn't want to feel like a spice girl? Next pair I have are some Demonias. If you watched my Depop Unif haul, these were in them. I did them like during the summer. I have a few shoes that were in that haul that will be in this video, just FYI. So if you wanna check out that video, I will link it, yeah. If you wanna check out that video, I will link it. Cool, thanks. Thank you. But yeah, these are my Mary Jane Demonias. They got a good, good honking platform like i want to say that's like a five inch platform in the back she's evolving from thinking two inches was crazy am i am i drowning oh i feel so short whenever i'm not wearing big platforms but i love these these are so girly and yet goth lolita and fun like and they're pretty comfy the the heels made of like a foam so they're not too like heavy or hard to walk in and they were like for the these are like 50 bucks which i feel like was like probably some of the cheapest platforms i have and they're such good quality i am gonna be buying a lot more demonias now Woo woo! okay the next the next little moment i have so if you live in a city that has a river in it or like i don't know austin's very like outdoorsy go to zilker park and like go swimming and stuff like that so whenever i am splashing in the town i have these platform tevas they are i believe an inch and a half and these are what i wear when i go swimming and they're like super comfortable they're just like foam like giant flip-flops i love them i love them i love them like they're just really easy shoes to put on and they look so cool and yeah, I wear them on road trips. The next pair of shoes I have for you are going to be these little Unif Mary Janes. Now, aren't these the most precious things you've ever done and saw? They are not really too platformy other than the big chunky block heel. Um, and for that reason, they're a little more uncomfortable to wear to work. Most of these shoes I've worn on an eight hour shift and my puppies end up barking. <laughs> woof woof! But these little Unif Mary Janes are just iconic. Like, they are a serve. They are a Sunday serve at best. Though, they are a Sunday serve always, even when it's not Sunday, baby. Just yummy. So precious, so cute. Just wanna eat it up, scrumptious. So, the next pair of shoes I have are going to be the Unif Jane shoes. These are actually like the first pair of Unif shoes I ever really got. 
purchased and I love them. They're just like chunky Oxfords kind of and they have these really cute heart charms. It's literally what sold me on these. Um, the heel is made out of foam so they're pretty lightweight and they're super super easy to walk. Like when I was first getting into platforms like these like real life saver and I still love them so much and there still always will be a look and there's just something about that cute charm that murders me that slays me dead the next pair of unif shoes I have are going to be the unif choke boots yes these are like my brats like iconic dream right such bad bitch energy rating radiating off of these bad boys they are just big honking platforms yet again there are foam heel base so you know they're not very heavy super super easy to walk in i would say after an eight hour shift these do kind of kill your feet though i don't know if that's just me everyone has their own foot like preferences and how long they can take i feel like maybe if i put some insoles in here i could last a little longer but yeah they're just such easy shoes to exist in this pair I have are the bubble platforms from Unif. These bad boys, I've fallen in and made my knees bleed, but still so worth it. They're just so fun and pretty and just shiny and elegant and big. Like that, that will destroy your soul, you know? Just like some, you know, just my curb stomping shoes, no big deal. They are so fun. But these are my big honking daddy Unif bubble shoes. I love them. They are just amazing. So these are my Parker boots from Unif. Yet again, foam heel, super fun to wear, super bad bitch shoes. This is what they look like. Oh, what the? Oh my god, this always happens to me. Can I even get this out? Ow, ow, ow. This is a sensor from my job, which is why I tend to wear big shoes. I have had one of these na ugh, sensor na nails go through like my tennis shoes and still stab my feet. Look how long that is. Ooh, Ooh I didn't even know that was in there. Are you okay? He's fine. It's, it's like no big deal to him. <laughs> but these are my Parker boots. I love them. They are just such, like, such clean, such beautiful little boots. They're like mid-calf boots. And I don't know. I love them. Like, oh. These are my Unif smoke boots. Just, just beautiful. Just absolutely exquisite like such powerful boots and i love wearing them with like long skirts or mini skirts and oh, they're just so hot and they're pretty easy to walk in so you know she can she can be tall and also dance <laughs> they're so cute i love them they're iconic and beautiful and i love them as I fall to my death. These are my Unif Gia sandals, slides, platforms. They're beautiful, beautiful. I got these secondhand off of Depop for way too much money, but I just, I needed them in my life. I wore them to work once though, and this strap kind of like hurt my foot. Like all the weight of the shoe is on this strap, which has, made me not want to wear them too much, but they're so 90s, so just bad baby. I need to force myself to wear them more, like, oh. And last but not least are my newest additions to my family. These are my Unif Wave platforms. Just so easy to get into. Uh, I don't know if you guys follow the artist B by Doobie, B by Doobie. Is that how B? We'll just call her B. But she's like from the UK and she just like sings grunge rock 
music. I love her. She's always rocking these and she made me want them so bad. She even wore the, the white platform boots in her music video and I was like, a slay queen. Um, but yes, these are just so fun. Not like I needed another pair of platforms, but you know, when you wear, when you wear platforms as much as I do, you, um, get a dick you just want more you want more you want more with me they're just beautiful they're like little works of art on your feet and i just appreciate them and admire them like you know it's nice to see a pair of shoes that you don't see every day and it's just that extra that extra spice that extra kick that really just really tops off my outfits if you know what i mean thank you so much for watching my platform shoe collection uh yeah don't forget to like and subscribe bye see you next time